Gemma Collins, folks. That's another one that I don't like. That'd be another one in my crosshairs. I barely know her, but I don't like her. She's done pretty well for herself. Another person that's done well for herself with absolutely no talent whatsoever. Is she the girl that um, refers to herself as the GC? I think she is. I don't know what it stands for, but pathetic. Anyway, read something today about her. She's uh, telling the, the public how she had to terminate her. Uh, a pregnancy a few years ago uh, yes seemingly the child that she had this should be a really sympathetic and sad story it's not the way I'll turn it around in a minute don't worry about that um, I know I'm going to get people having a go at me I don't really care yeah she terminated a pregnancy because um, the medical people were saying it was going to be an intersex child now an intersex child for those that don't know I had a good idea myself thought I was spot on and turns out I was when I looked at on the internet to see what it is an intersex child is one where you may be a, a boy and you've got uh, a lot of female char characteristics or vice versa you could even be a boy and you could have the old Auntie Annie or you could be a girl and have the old uh, Desmond Decker or you could have a bit of both you know there could be anything down there you just don't know uh, and I thought right okay then that's fine why would you terminate? I thought, is there, is there something bad about being an intersex child? Is it life-threatening? Do you live a shorter life? You know, Does it cause massive problems for you? And I looked it up, no issues at all, no problem there. And I thought, well, again, why would you terminate? And I thought, well, is it because you don't want the child, whoever it may have been, whether you brought up a boy or a girl or whatever, um, getting ridiculed and laughed at? Uh, number one, that everybody would need to know. And number two, I thought we were in times now where there's a lot more, um, what's the word, a lot more, appro approval's the wrong word, but we're a lot more, we, we embrace other folk, different folk, folk that, you know, have different characteristics and whatever else, you know. We're at a time now where we're, we're happy for Harry to become Mary and Mary to become Harry. There's no issue whatsoever. Um, you know, if somebody wants sex changes and whatever else, they, we've no problem with that. We've no problem with anything, accepting that's the word. We're an accepting society to a, a, a great extent, I believe. You know, we don't necessarily all want people's views rammed down our throat, but we're a live and let live society. Well, I hope we are. I certainly am myself. I wouldn't have a problem whether a child was intersex or disabled. It wouldn't matter to me one iota. Wouldn't be bothered at all. Certainly wouldn't think of denying that person life because of that and I couldn't believe what I was reading and I thought to myself isn't this Gemma Collins isn't she one of the ones one of the many ones that uh, is loved by the LGBT and all those things I'm, I'm sure she is I'm sure she is and I'm thinking well do they all know that and how would they feel about that I thought I just couldn't believe what I read and when I read that it's, it's no harm on life and you know you've not got a shorter life or you know great problems in life you may have some mental issues you may not I don't know it depends how you are about it, you know, but but I couldn't believe what I read. I thought, why on earth would you terminate that? Couldn't believe it, folks. I really couldn't. I don't know what you think. Am I right? Am I wrong? Let me know. Um, you know, I, I don't think I'm wrong. I shouldn't, certainly wouldn't have gotten rid of a young child because of that. That wouldn't bother me one iota. You know, wouldn't bother me at all. Um, I don't know. I just couldn't believe it when I read it. Couldn't believe it at all. Thought I'd tell you.